All right, guys, here's uh, my first video for the uh, Altel Ultra. So I'm just taking a look at it now, and I'm going to tell you, if you go into diagnostics, uh, you have all your vehicles. So this will look similar to your other Altel scanner if you have one, or if you've seen one or used one or whatever or whatnot. So let's say you're like, all right, well, I'm in my scanner, I'm in a car, I'm not hooked up to one, obviously, so I can't show you that yet. But so... You're in your scanner, and now you want to go into split screen mode. So it just split the screen. Now I want to go into my scope because I want to do some bi-directional controls, and I want to see if the scope will actually uh, show me where my issue is, right? So I'm in split screen. I'm going to go to my oscilloscope. I can go to multimeter or whatever else. There's your scope right here. You have full functions. You can get into all your uh, sensors, everything else. I'm already into the high-speed can or whatever, but... Uh, you can get into anything you want from here. Uh, you can get into all your all your settings. Uh, it's looking for my Bluetooth. I don't have one set up yet, but uh, all your settings are here. So if you want to do 20 volts per division, get out of there. Uh, there you go. So uh, uh, it's pretty amazing. Uh, I've yet to see a scanner. I know the Zeus uh, or a Snap-on can do it. I think the Verus Edge and the Zeus. Uh, once you're into the troubleshooter, you can do it, and this is kind of the same thing. Uh, now, guys, when you pick your um, whatever you're doing, it's going to come up with your general descriptions, and I'll do another video on this as well. But it tells you your uh, test guidance, your diagram, and then example waveform. You can actually click this to open it up, and there's your example, right? Close it out. Now it's going to tell you about the analysis of it, how it works, disclaimer, and then to close it out, uh, actually let me go up here so I can show you. You can actually go into parameters and see what your channels are set at as well. Uh, you can see your sample rate, what your sample in at, sample size, interval, etc. Now I want to get rid of this, so I'm just going to hit the arrow here and close that out. So that's pretty slick. So now you can do your bidirectional testing and you can see your scope at the same exact time amazing pretty amazing so this was the first video i wanted to get out for you guys i'll do a lot more i'll show you the scope i'll show you the opening package uh what comes with it etc uh so stay tuned this is going to be uh quite the series thanks for watching